Yeah, Paul Jess officers tell me they gave this rancher a chance to make things right, and when he didn't, they had to move in, seizing more than 40 head of limousine cattle. Now at the barn behind the shelter, many of them not even in that good of a condition. In fact, I just want to show you the tail of one of the females here, collapsed in a trailer right now due to dehydration. Vets currently trying to revive her. A very serious situation on the south side, but when he tried to talk to the owner about why he did it, he didn't have much to say. It's the moment officers hand Richard Butler 45 citations for neglecting 45 cattle. And this is the moment he decided he didn't want to talk. Hey, y'all guys, get this out of here. We don't need this. We don't need this. We don't need this. After a swing and a few words we won't repeat, Butler left animal control to round up his cows. Officers say were long abandoned. There's some evidence of uh, dead animals out here. For the type of cows they are, they're way too thin. Uh, some of them are injured. Thursday's roundup, a judge ordered, who said Butler failed to improve conditions. We found a busted water trough bone dry. The only food? A few rotten bales of hay and a trailer cattle wouldn't even come close to. And for whatever reasons, they don't want to come up here, and which is a bad sign because if they're fed normally, they would be used to coming up here and they're not. Volunteer cowboys did their best to bring skittish cows back in, ending a potential death sentence under a blazing summer sun. In Oklahoma, it's not unheard of. In Oklahoma City, it is. And a live look now at the more than 40 head of limousine cattle here back behind the OKC Animal Shelter. Seeing them eating, a very good sight for vets here. These cattle are going to remain here until they can be properly nursed back to health and until Butler can prove he can responsibly take care of these animals. We're live, Morgan Chesky, KOCO 5 News.